How do you select a good melon? Okay, so watermelons, uh, first of all, you, you should know that we have people picking them for you. You don't have to worry about picking them in the store because they've already been selected for you by people who do this all the time. We have a crew of professionals. Uh, that's all they do is they, they select watermelons. This is the one we ship commercially all over the U.S. It's a red flesh mini seedless watermelon. This melon doesn't have a belly, so you couldn't, we wouldn't be able to look at the belly anyway. You could thump it, but do you know what to hear for? So on a large one, see, you're more likely to see a ground spot. It could be white, it could be yellow. Uh, the main thing that the, the professional cutter is looking for is the stripes. So we have many kinds here. So we have one here that looks just like the one I showed you, but it's yellow inside. It looks the same on the outside, but then look at the inside. It's, it's very sweet and juicy. Tastes like a watermelon, maybe just a little bit different than the red flesh one, but, but it's very enjoyable. Then these are red inside. For people who want bigger ones, we go bigger ones. And then we have some here that are orange inside. And I will, I will probably cut one of these too. Orange inside, see? This one has a few seeds. You can get seeds sometimes. And then over here we have one that's uh, dark. On the outside, there's some people who like that. And it's kind of what is called a sugar baby type. And, and it, it's very dark red on the inside and, and very sweet. Our watermelons are grown right here locally. And we can ship them all over the country, but um, they are grown here under very good conditions. Watermelons like hot, dry weather, which we have. Our season for watermelons here uh, on our farm starts around, uh, around the 20th to the 25th of June and will go all the way into October. So many people come here to our farm stand and they'll, a they'll ask me, which is your sweetest melon? And I will tell them, you know, it's not about sweet. Our melons are about flavor. We have a whole bunch of different melons here and they each have their own unique flavor. When you taste this melon, you cut it open and, and when you first taste it, it'll be different than anything else you ever had. The first thing you're going to think about is not the sweetness, is the flavor. It's going to hit you like an explosion in your mouth and you're going to say, wow, just like that for the flavor, not for the sweetness. Because they have a hard shell, watermelons can also sit on your shelf for, for days or maybe even weeks, okay? As long as they're in, in a place where they don't get real hot, like they're not by the window where there's sun, uh, put them, you know, someplace where it's cool and you can store a watermelon there for several weeks actually and cut it up and it's fine.